For our last video in this series, we'll review some additional troubleshooting tips. If you've reprogrammed the Pro X out of the box, there may be a few inhibited features on this model. These are features that are inhibited due to other control settings. Please refer to the installation operation manual for more information. If you come across the Pro X LCD screen as blank and will not awaken by pressing any key, check for the following. No power to the control. Check for line voltage to the control, at least 102 volts. Check all electrical connections. When power is restored, the screen will light up. A three second boot up will display version information and the power icon in the top left hand corner will be visible. If the burner will not come on, check that the limits are powered. Check for power on limit in terminal. The limit icon should be visible on the screen. Is the T1, T2 circuit closed? The TT icon should be visible on the screen. Is the control in lockout? Press the reset button for one second. Warning, if the control locks out three times in a single call for heat cycle, latch up occurs and will be displayed on the screen. Only a qualified technician should reset the control after latch up and the problem that has caused the latch up should be corrected before returning the burner to normal service. To reset from latch up, you must press and hold the reset button for 30 seconds. Is the CAD cell sensing a flame or does it see stray light? Check the Pro X screen. Is the flame icon visible? Press the up arrow button to display CAD cell ohms. Dark resistance in the combustion chamber should be over 50,000 ohms. Is light leaking into the burner housing? Check for stray light by measuring the CAD cell resistance as it is looking into the inactive combustion chamber. Remember, it should be greater than 50,000 ohms. If the CAD cell is defective, replace the CAD cell. Is there a problem with the CAD cell wiring or the holder? Replace the CAD cell harness. If the appliance was recently shut down, the CAD cell may be seeing residual hot spots in the chamber. Wait a few moments for the chamber to cool down. Check to see if there's a flame in the combustion chamber. Correct this condition before operating the burner. Other no start problems may be insufficient line voltage. If your line voltage is less than 102 volts, Check the wiring. Check the incoming voltage. Is the motor relay welded? If all wiring is correct and there is no voltage passing into the valve circuit, the motor relay is welded. Replace the control. You must also determine if the motor amperage is within the listed rating, the listed load rating of the Pro X control. Pump prime, also known as bleeding. If you need to bleed the pump, press the reset button for five seconds. This will initiate a pump prime mode which operates the motor, oil valve, and igniter for 120 seconds. During the time, the Pro X will attempt to purge any air from the fuel pump. Be sure to follow pump prime procedure for the specific fuel unit. Check our installation and operating manual for a complete list of service and troubleshooting. Thank you.